Andy, today is the day that I've prayed for for so long. God has answered my prayers by giving me you. I'm so blessed that today I get to marry someone so wonderful. You are so beautiful in every way. You are patient, kind, and loving. In Corinthians, it says that love is just that. It also says that love always protects, trusts, hopes, and always perseveres. Most of all, love never fails. Thank you for being the definition of love, the love that God designed. Marriage displays the glory and grace of God by picturing the unbreakable relationship between Christ and His church. I promise to maintain humility, be gentle and patient with all while being eager to keep the spirit center of our bond. I promise to love you when you are down. I promise to love you just as I love myself. I will love you just like Christ loved the church and gave himself up for the church. I promise to treat you with understanding, patience, and kindness, not being easily angered, not self-seeking. I promise to forgive you just as God has forgiven us. I promise to honor you and treat you as my equal. And I'm honored to become your wife. Today I vow to laugh with you always, to forgive quickly, to support you in all of your endeavors. I vow to care for you in sickness and in health. I vow to worship our loving God with you. And most of all, I vow to love you endlessly. I promise to love you just as Christ has loved us and has sacrificed for us. And I promise to be a shepherd for our family, to look to God for guidance so that we are not led astray. For as long as we both shall live, I promise to keep this holy covenant true. Thank you, Andy, for always loving me, for always supporting me, and for always making me feel like the most beautiful person in the room. You're a blessing in my love story that I've always dreamed of. I'm so in love with you, and I can't wait for our forever. I love you, Nat. I pronounce that they are husband and wife together in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Those whom God has joined together, let no man put asunder. Andy, you may kiss your bride. <laughs> It is now my great privilege to introduce to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Andy Shaw.